Hello friends, welcome back to Technique. Today we'll be talking about Oxygen OS 15. So Oxygen OS 15 has been officially launched uh, globally uh, by OnePlus and this is available right now for the uh, OnePlus 12 and it is coming uh, for other devices as well. So we'll be having a look at how good the Oxygen OS 15 is on the OnePlus 12. So we have installed the Oxygen OS 15 along with that it gets Android 15 out of the box. So let's see how good the experience is, what all new features it brings in and uh, also the update cycle for other devices from oneplus uh, to get this uh, oxygen os 15 so we'll also quickly look at how different the oxygen os 15 compared to the oxygen os 14 uh, launched last year so let's begin so before that if this is your first time on this channel do hit that red subscribe button and also hit the bell icon to get notified of all the videos we publish so let's begin so we have updated our uh, oneplus 12 to android 15 and oxygen os 15 so let's just show you about phone first so about device so OnePlus 12 and Oxygen OS 15, you can see the new uh, look and feel about the device. Now this is running uh, the Android 15 updates, you can see here, uh, Oxygen OS 15 and you can see here Android 15 is the version. So this is the UI and uh, you can see all the details here. So it's a new about device page, it looks very good. And let's uh, see what all features it brings. So first let's have a look at the notification toggle. So you can see here the new notification toggle looks uh, uh, different it has uh, uh, the uh, icons are much more circular in nature the edges have curved but then you can actually customize this as well so you can go to the settings and customize this and uh, if you go here uh, if you can see here notification and quick settings uh, quick settings bar you can see here there is a new way split screen uh, notification toggle where you get the quick settings and the notification separately and the classic one this is the classic one where you get the notification here and you can expand this now let's just go to the split one so split one you can swipe here you can see all the uh, quick toggles and uh, swipe from the left side uh, you get the notification so this is a split view and you also get the classic view now apart from that uh, you can also uh, show uh, the classic one you can see here in the classic one uh, the tile shape is there so you can see the default tile is curved now you can also go with the complete square uh, then uh, window square kill 2 rhombus square kill 1 so these are the options available so you can customize uh, the tile shape here and uh, looks good now the split screen option is something which we have seen on xiaomi devices so there are uh, split view one is for notification and one is for cube toggle so this option is included with a new uh, toolbar and you can see that uh, icons looks much uh, cleaner and the um, the notification toggle looks good the animations are also done better so overall it looks cool uh, in the notification toggle now if you go to the app drawer so you can see here app drawer nothing much changed but the icons are given a refreshing look and it is slightly bigger in uh, size and looks uh, pretty good and uh, if you press and hold you can see here wallpaper icons widgets layouts uh, all these things remain the same more or less remain the same uh, let's uh, go to the next option let's uh, see the uh, settings panel so this is the settings panel you can see here it has been changed again here you can see a circular in nature and the icons here has been changed so if you look at uh, the uh, older oxygen os 14 so this uh, is oxygen os 14 you can see here side by side view uh, you can see here now here we have colorful icons now these have uh, been made uh, the circular uh, uh, the color around the icon has been removed and uh, it looks very much uh, pleasing it looks much more cleaner actually this looks much more cleaner again it's more of a personal choice so what do you guys think which of these is better in terms of looks uh, this is uh, more cleaner i feel uh, than the original one so that's the way it looks now now apart from that uh, you can also see that uh, uh, there has been a change in the wallpaper and style so th this is a massive change flux themes brings in a whole lot of themes and uh, options uh, to customize so just click here and uh, you can uh, you can see here more themes you can see plenty of new themes are added with uh, the lock screen and aod options but uh, none of these are customizable you can't add your own text actually but that should have been included uh, you can use these text but you cannot add your own text that's kind of uh, i would feel uh, it's a very easy implementation which oneplus could have done but it is not available so you can uh, customize uh, you can't literally customize you can just apply here so for example just apply this lock screen 
So there you go. You can't uh, customize the text. That's one of the downsides of uh, this option. Now there is also wallpaper option. So you can see a plenty of new wallpapers are included. Then always on display is also there. You can see here seamless, uh, classic. Uh, then uh, you can also see additional options. But there are personalized songs. But uh, whatever is included in the flux themes uh, is not customizable. Basically, you have to use those themes only. So that's uh, the uh, themes available. Uh, so overall design definitely looks good. Uh, it has been improved. And if you go to the icons, uh, literally we'll just show you the icons once again. And if you go to the icons, now there are two more icons options. Radiance and Shadow are the two icons. You can see Radiance is a bit more uh, a polished one. And then uh, we have the Shadow option. So these are two new icon uh, packs added apart from the material and payable option. So th you can just apply this uh, new um, uh, icon pack are included in the new theme now what you can see is the smoothness of uh, the ui you can see here it's very uh, fluid in terms of uh, ui experience you can see the animations are much more smoother and looks very good actually and if you can see here the animations here also looks uh, very much pleasing so these are some things uh, which has been improved the animations have been drastically improved and uh, the response is also very smooth actually so that's one of the good things about uh, this new ui apart from the uh, design changes and also added themes now there is a whole lot of uh, ai tools included in the image editor so we'll just uh, take an image here and if you go to the edit option you can see here ai editor now if you select uh, you can see here ai uh, detailed uh, detail boost so what this then does is if you enable the uh, or if you apply the ai detail boost the details will be much more sharper and uh, it gets you uh, images which uh, where the details are lost you can get back the details with the ai tool so ai detail boost 4k uh, option then ai eraser which has been already there then ai unblur which means if you are taking a photo and it is blurred uh, for some reason uh, while taking the image it is blur then you can enable the unblur option and uh, use uh, this then you can also remove reflection say for example if you have taken a picture and there is a reflection of some object uh, on your photo you can use the ai reflection eraser to remove the reflection again these are things which again needs improvement uh, the uh, detail boost is actually pretty good but the reflection erase is not perfect uh, uh, we'll show you a separate example of this but uh, as of now it looks uh, pretty good actually uh, but then it needs a bit more fine tuning so these are the ai tools included uh, in this uh, ui and apart from that uh, the notes application uh, which also has been uh, improved there are a lot of uh, new tools included in the notes so we just select a note and if you add here you can uh, select here this is the ai tool so you can see a format obviously uh, the option to format cleanup cleanup basically uses the ai tool to clean up the article maybe it reduces uh, the uh, uh, the unwanted words or uh, phrases and then uh, it cleans up then polishes again uh, it makes it better then uh, you can do continue writing elaborate and shorten these are th two options if you want to elaborate something what you written you can use the option then shorten is there then uh, what type of language you want you want the uh, the notes to be formal uh, way of communicating or if you want casual you can go with that so these are the options available in the ai notes so you can uh, have have them uh, enabled just by selecting the text and you can use these AI assistant tools available in the uh, Oxygen OS 15. Now there is also an Easter egg in uh, the OnePlus calculator app. So just click OnePlus and click equal to you can see here in the never settle logo. So this has been there. Then there is also uh, the new SuperVOOC uh, uh, charging animation included. This looks much better and cleaner. So the basic uh, importance is about the animation that has been refined and looks much better now. Uh, you can see that uh, all the icons have been given much more better animation so it's very smooth and uh, the animations have been done really well now there is also the open canvas uh, which we have seen on uh, the one plus open so you just swipe here you can see here you can uh, just uh, enable uh, the split screen option now you can just go here till the top almost like a uh, 90 percentage you can go with uh, the split screen option so you can see here this is the new option you can go with almost 90 percentage so open canvas is something which has been there uh, in uh, which has been really good implementation on the oneplus open so that has been made available here as well then apart from that uh, you also get the fluid uh, uh, cloud so fluid cloud is something which we have shown uh, uh, when uh, oneplus uh, oxygen os uh, 14 was released so we'll just show you that uh, now uh, we'll just take the clock application and i will just show you if you set uh, uh, a timer and then minimize you can see this is uh, the uh, 
the fluid cloud now fluid cloud has been expanded to other apps uh, mainly swiggy and zomato has been included here in india if you are using those application you will get this uh, and it also comes for music player and host of other applications coming soon so this will be expanded to other applications as well so you can just uh, uh, tap on it and it will bring up uh, you can press and hold and you can go to the application so this is how it works you can just uh, minimize or close uh, uh, the fluid cloud then uh, apart from that there is also the theft protection which is uh, basically a google uh, android uh, uh, feature so you can see here theft protection is there so someone uh, snatches your phone and runs away uh, it will automatically detect you can just enable uh, the theft protection and then offline uh, device lock is also included so these are the options available in android 15 so that has been carried forward here as well then apart from that you can see that memory management and uh, uh, the uh, option to switch uh, uh, op uh, the apps is very similar if you look at the camera ui there isn't much of a change included in the camera ui so it looks more or less similar uh, nothing much changed probably in the final version we might see some changes but we are not really sure but as of now the camera ui looks more or less similar so that's the ui options uh, and overall i feel uh, uh, android 15 and oxynos 15 is definitely an improved one and a lot of in, uh, new features have come uh, the more focus is on the animations and uh, how fluid the ui is apart from that some design changes ai inclusion is also there then superbook animation uh, then new wallpapers and lock screen so so, uh, plenty of options available and this is the oxyno 15 with android 15 on one plus 12 so in the coming days we will see the final rollout uh, uh, and uh, these are some of the new features coming to the ui so if you have the one plus 12 you can try out this uh, new version but again this is not the final build so it might have some errors and here is the uh, Oxygen OS 15 rollout timeline given by OnePlus for all the devices. So you can see uh, when your device will be getting the Oxygen OS 15 and uh, Android 15 uh, from OnePlus. That was uh, the Oxygen OS 15 on the OnePlus 12. Hope you enjoyed watching this video. Do hit that like button and also hit the subscribe button for more videos. Thanks for watching. Hope to see you in our next video. Have a great day.